for your audio. It's all well and good having commentators audio and then you're just behind the camera and not listening to what the camera is recording because if something goes wrong with a microphone, you're not going to know until you get back on your computer and look at the footage later. So having some headphones plugged in, someone dedicated to monitoring the audio is really important. So your camera needs that. HDMI output I'll get to in a second. It has a nice flippy out screen, which is quite big, but there's something else I'll get to to upgrade. It has a big battery. This is an aftermarket battery, which covers an entire football match. We've got two of these now though, just in case. Uh, this one also has dual card slots. So I'm recording to one card and it's copying to the other card. So if you have a card failure, you've got your footage on two cards. So that's very important. And that's why this was a little bit more expensive as well. But they're things to look out for. I'd go for the biggest sensor. Make sure you've got an external microphone input of some kind, not necessarily XLR. Make sure you've got a headphone monitor and make sure you've got a remote control and a HDMI output. Why do I want a, re a remote control? Blah, 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 blah. 